Models need to understand one thing about modeling agents. No matter if they are working at the top most reputable agencies in the world, it does not mean that they have any idea what they are doing. Firstly, finding people that work in any creative field in the entertainment industry who understand how business and marketing work is very, very rare, which is why I heavily emphasize that in and throughout my content. Creative people for some reason resist understanding business and that trend does not stop with model agents. Here's the truth. A lot of model agents have no clue how to run a business, brand a product, or even market that product. And guess what? You are that product that they focus on. So when you're aware of that, and then you know how model agents get paid, you can understand what their motive to work is and why models today are working a lot less than they were 20 years ago. Most model agents nowadays get paid salaries, which means they work until 5 p.m. and then they dip. They are not invested beyond when they finish because, well, what incentive do they have to care about their talent? Talent beyond that. To them, it's just like any other nine to five job. No one is going to work beyond the time they need to if they're going to get paid the exact same amount of money. So what does this mean? It means some model agents can actually have a very careless approach to how they handle their talent. It means that some agents won't actually update your book when they should, or they aren't actually pushing you as hard as they need to be. And sometimes their uninformed opinion can restrict you from changing up your look and putting in more versatile content in your portfolio. While they work for the agency, they may not actually be representing you well. But then there are the agents that are getting paid a salary plus commission or just commission. And these agents should technically be the ones that are a lot more motivated to make you into stars because they know they will make more money if you get more jobs. So they're going to be pushing you harder to their clients, encouraging you to do things that will make you more valuable, and they will actually be looking out for your best interest. And honestly, that's what you want in an agent. You don't want someone who just clocks in and clocks out. You want someone that is writing for you. You want someone that is responding to your messages and that actually cares and feels like they're invested in your success. So if I was a model and I was signed to an agency, I would probably try to figure out which agents are on salary and which are getting commission because then I'll be able to tell which ones actually have my best interest. And I'll be able to understand why some models are their favorites because that means those models bring them in more money. And if all your agents are on salary, then this is why it's important to learn how to represent yourself even while you're signed to a top modeling agency. And this is what I teach in my how to become a model masterclass. I turn models into business owners and I equip them with the skills they need to be able to brand themselves and make themselves more valuable for their agents and for beyond the agency that they're with. So if you're interested in becoming a more valuable model, click the link in my bio to learn more.